How you doing? This is Gerald. Gerald Reynolds in Portland, Oregon. Uh, why did you send me this stupid movie? I don't... You know, I'm not a Christian. Okay? I don't have any deities or gods. I don't believe in any of your religions. Your religion is no better than the Christian religion. It's no better than Jews. It's no better than the Muslim. It's, it's all the same mythological, phony baloney, make-believe crap. The problem with uh, Islam is that you keep everybody in the Stone Age. You don't want them to progress. You don't want women to be equal. You don't want women to be within their own rights. You don't want uh, your children to have what they deserve. You don't... You don't want people to uh, use electronics or something. You want people to pray five, six times a fucking day. What is wrong with you people? Look at your countries. No sidewalks. Hardly any cars. No buildings. Your people all live in shacks and tents all over the fucking desert. What the hell makes your religion so great? Why don't you just be human beings? Let's put it this way. If you come to me and say to me, hi, my name is Salam Imbalam, or whatever it is, and say I'm from where it's so and so, and you just start talking to me about your culture, I'm going to be impressed. I'm going to listen to you. I'm going to be glad to hear it. I love history. I love to hear about other cultures. But when those cultures are overworked and overtrodden by religions, especially despotic Stone Age religions like yours. You just, it, life goes dull. It goes static. There's no more progress. There's no, there's nothing to do. You end up living in the sand and everything's all, you fuck. You cover your women from head to toe. You say it's to revere them. We know better, okay? We know that it's a control tool. We know it all along. The Christians do it too. They just don't do it in the open anymore. They hide it now. You, you want to open it. You want to tell everybody that it's okay to beat your wife and this is how you do it. Because your Quran said so. And you think the book is so, it's the word of God because it hasn't changed? So what? You people all think there's some kind of like miracle science in this book. What the fuck? Come on, just stop it. I don't want you to send me these stupid ass movies. Unless you have some reasonable, rational discussion. I don't need to say them. I don't care about Geert Wilders. Sounds like he was Jewish anyway. Why would you want to listen to him? You people are going over there. You go, you're in Europe. And you want to cover your women up. You want to still cover your women up and beat them and everything else. You want to do everything you've been able to do in all your other countries. But in European countries... That's against the law. You can't be beating people up for no reason. You can't be beating your wife just because your fucking holy book says so. I'm not playing that shit anymore. We're not doing it anymore. I'm not, not appeasing you anymore. I'm not having any accommodation anymore. You're not going to get any respect from me. Your religion is shit, stone age, despotic, and I've had enough. I don't have to respect it. I don't have to respect you, Catholic priests, rabbis, or any of you fucking control freaks. I don't have to respect any of you whatsoever. And I don't. You're idiotic, despotic fools. And that's about it. You want to cut pieces of people's baby boys off, their penis off. What the fuck is wrong with you people? How could you still want to do that? You make me sick. And now that now that, now the Muslims are coming out with, oh yeah, we know Jesus. Yeah, he was a prophet of God too. They're just trying to get accepted. That's all they're doing. They're all conniving machinations. Every one of them. The Catholic religion has been so insidious that they've got the whole freaking... They've got, we got all kinds of shit named just because of the Catholic religion. All kinds of things. Closing churches on Sunday or things on Sunday and uh, saying bless you and you know all this stuff when you sneeze say bless you. All this crap. And it's all from religious dogma. And the sooner we get it out of our heads, the better off we'll all be. You people, however, have got it so tight in your freaking cultures, you've got your women actually accepting the burqa and, and making videos saying they, they want to be 
oppressed. They want to be subjugated and made to feel like third-class citizens and treated like dogs because God said they should because they're wicked. Fuck you. You're a piece of shit. You're all perverts and all y'all are a bunch of damn sexually frustrated pedophiles. There could be no other reason that you would even think of doing things like this to people. Everything in your whole system, it seems like every kind of rule, every kind of law has something to do with sex. You people are sick. Your martyrs die. They go to get 72 virgins. What the fuck? Why is it virgins? Why do you have to have a virgin? Why, why would you want a virgin? This could be a 9, 10-year-old girl, you freak. And Muhammad, marrying 6-year-old child, married the child, the book says. And we know what the word means. Consummate. You're all pedophiles, perverts. I'm sick of you. Don't respect you, and I'm not going to accommodate you any longer. This is it. I'll make a video every fucking night about you freaking people. I'm, I'm dead tired. I'm sick of it. I, I see it every day now. All the time, you people crying about being able to cover your women up. Slave drivers. That's all you got. I'm done. Bye. Gerald, signing off. Portland, Oregon. Fuck you, too.